Is there some oats for breakfast? Yes, some oats for breakfast. Some oats for apple. Apple. Lovely. This is our view. One of our spots here. Right, good morning. No, we're, we're in Eswatini and just been for a run this morning. Um, I will let Susie tell you why we're in Eswatini. Um, we're in Eswatini because we're volunteering with a not for profit called Medical Missions Eswatini who um, work to try and provide healthcare to um, people who live in this area and Mozambique in South Africa. So I was here three years ago and I was volunteering as a doctor here but then had to come home early because of Covid but I've stayed in touch with everyone so I, well we, decided to come back and um, yeah I brought Ross with me. It's been very relaxed out here. It's, um, it's really really beautiful and um, it's, it's, it's nice to see so many people doing such wonderful work. Right, so I'm going to give you a bit of a, a walking tour of Mvuda Farm, um, just to show you where we've been. So up there has been the little cottage that we've been staying at. Ahead of us here is the stables, the hangar, an airfield, some mercy air, helicopter lines. It's a little cottage up there. There's John and Helen's house. Very beautiful. Right, so we know what I call the village green. We have uh, the green shed over there, which is like a roastery and a coffee shop. And then around on the other side is the um, main farm store. And more chalets down here. Yeah, we've got swimming pool. This is Susie's favourite house. Now coming through the orchard. Things growing down here. Getting some uh, coffee beans. There's items here called dragon fruit. And it's just about to start raining, so that's the end of the walking tour.